Hey guys, this is Krisa. This was requested by DGML Max and um, she or he wanted to know how do you always get a good petal placement when drawing the flowers? And she said, I always end up with an odd size gap that looks strange with or without one more petal. So I don't know, I eyeball everything. So I don't know, I've been doing this for a long time that I don't even think about it. But I guess for some people it is harder to what do you call it it is harder to gauge or to just eyeball everything but yeah here's how here's how i would do it i've been doodling since i could remember i was i love drawing ever since i was little so um i've been really like drawing almost all my life i just never really noticed it until recently when i discovered a zentangle so yeah here's how i would do it Sorry, the camera is shaky. I'm holding it with my left hand. Um, you start with a circle. It doesn't have to be a perfect circle. That's the beauty of it. That's the beauty of doodling. You just sort of like create whatever shapes you like and it will always look good at the end. I can, I can tell you that. Okay, so and then you create these line guides. I would like divide the circle into it like a pie. Um, you start with a line straight line and then a, a line across and then a slanted line from where you're sitting because that would be a straight line if you were sitting on that direct on on that direction so yeah i'm gonna bubble on i know it but i'm gonna try not to so you use these lines as a guide and um okay you start from the end here from the end of this slanted line and then you go over to the next line and you just do that throughout the circle and you will have your perfect petal shapes without the odd you know spaces in between and then you can spread out the design as you you know whatever with whatever shapes you prefer so um, I'm going to do more curves so I would do that. It doesn't really have to be perfect. As you can see here, that is bigger than this shape here. And to me, it doesn't matter. Because like um, DGML Max said, in real life, flowers aren't really, don't have um, perfect petals. I mean, they don't have the same petals. They are all different. So it doesn't matter. And then you just keep doing that. You can do other shapes too, like, hold on, I'll show you. I hope the camera is showing it. Oh, there you go. And then you make another shape. So you put like a circle here on top of the curves, like at the very top of the curb, like this. And then you create like a leaf shape. That's how I would do it, guys. I don't know. And then from then on, you can just create your own shapes, your own shapes. Make the flower bigger. You can leave it small. I don't know. But that's, that's basically what I do. And, um, and if you use a pencil to, for your um, line guides, you can erase the, the lines later and put shapes like this I don't know there's a name for the shape in Sintango world but I don't know the name and you can just do that and no one will know that you had a guide when you started the flower so yeah that's how I would do it guys thanks so much for watching and if you want me to create or do another tutorial on something let me know I mean I don't I didn't go to art school i know that i probably need to but i don't have the money to do it so <laughs> i'm just doing really whatever and um sometimes it's best that way because you don't have all these rules to follow which i don't like rules are not my thing but yeah so that's how i would do it and you can just add more lines like this just do what you think looks good that's what I do most of the time. So there you go.
and there's a flower shape for you with almost the same flower shapes <laughs> okay thanks guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this and let me know if you want me to do something else i mean yeah i'm gonna use my iphone because it's so easy for me i can just upload it whenever and yeah thank you guys for watching take care have a wonderful new year 2016 it's going to be awesome i hope so anyway god permits and um yeah take care and god bless and have a fantastic 2016 bye